There is therefore now no condemnation to them which are in Christ Jesus who walk not after the flesh but after the spirit. For the law of the spirit of life in Christ Jesus that made me free from the law of sin and death. What the law could not do in that it was weak through the flesh, God sending his own son in the likeness of sinful flesh, and for sin condemned sin in the flesh. That the righteousness of the law might be fulfilled in us, who walk not after the flesh, but after the spirit. For they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh, but they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. For to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually minded is life and peace. Because the carnal mind is enmity against God. For it is not subject to the law of God, neither indeed can it be. So then, they that are in the flesh cannot please God. But ye are not in the flesh, but in the spirit. If so be that the spirit of God dwell in you. Now if any man have not the spirit of Christ, he is none of his. And if Christ be in you, the body is dead because of sin, yes, sir. but the spirit is life because of righteousness. But if the spirit of him that raised him, raised up Jesus from the dead dwell in you, he that raised up Christ from the dead shall also quicken your mortal bodies by the spirit that dwelleth in you. Therefore, brethren, we are debtors, not to the flesh, to live after the flesh. For if we live after the flesh, he shall die. But if she, if he live through the spirit, if he live through the spirit, do mortify the deeds, deeds of the spirit, he shall live. For as many as are led by the spirit, they are the sons of God. For ye have not received the spirit of bondage again to fear, but ye have received the spirit of adoption, whereby we cry, Abba, Father. The Spirit itself bears witness with our spirit that we are children of God. And if children, then heirs, heirs of God, and joint heirs with Christ. And if so be that we suffer with him, that we may be also glorified with him. For I reckon that the sufferings of this present time are not worthy to be compared with the glory which shall be revealed in us. For the earnest expectation of the creature waited for the manifestation of the sons of God. For the creature was made subject to vanity, 
not willingly, but by reason of him who has subject, subjected the same in hope. May the Lord have a blessing to the reading and the hearing of his word. Amen. time let the church say amen. amen isn't God good come on can you give us some praise this morning praise is what I do it's prayer time won't he do it I know you will do it Diane he'll, he'll do it but you gotta ask him if he abides in you and you and he somebody said I got the hook up Like a refrigerator been plugged into the wall, but when you pull that plug out, everything on the inside goes to waste. Yeah, yeah. Well. Unless you got a generator, which is a backup generator. But I don't need no backup generator because I got the hookup. <laughs> oh, won't you come to the altar? God is still in the blessing business. I don't know about you, but I feel good this morning. First of all, it's another beginning of the week, Sunday. It's the Lord's Day. Yesterday we was looking into the future. The future is now, now, and the history was yesterday. Hoping that tomorrow will be. And if it don't be, if God don't do nothing else, guess what? <laughs> he done enough. Somebody said, well, what did he do for you? Well, <laughs> he woke me up this morning. Oh, I was told in my right frame of mind. And I looked all right then. Oh yeah, oh yeah, won't he do it? Pray for one another, the one behind you, the one in front of you, the one beside you. He needs to pray for yourself. God's able, I don't care what you're struggling with. He's able to do anything but fail. His yes is as good as his no. His no is as good as his yes. And you might have to wait a while. Somebody prayed something back in 1986. Got answered yesterday. But guess what? Won't he do it? Somebody pray for the family of Governor Senator Evan Biden's wife passed. Lift him in prayers. The Perkins family, lift him in prayers. Those in convalescent homes, lift him. Those in the hospitals, lift him. But guess what, y'all? We're going to praise him this morning. Because he's worthy to be praised. Father, which are in heaven, 
I'm going to be thy name. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Would you give us this day our daily bread? Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from me. Lord, we lift our eyes into the hills from which comes all of our help. And our help comes from thee. Lord, you are God besides there is no other. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you for being who you are. Oh, Thank you. you sit high and you look low. Lord, we again at the altar. Some have problems. You know where they are. But Lord, what we're going to do this morning is we're going to put those problems on the back burner. And we're going to praise your name this morning because you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, God, for being better to us than we have our own self. Lord, somebody said you would do it right here, right now. Somebody said you did it yesterday. You did it day before yesterday. And somebody said you just keep on doing what you're doing. And we want to thank you. Oh Lord, we're so grateful. Look down into the bottom of our heart and whatever is ailing us to keep us from worshiping you, we ask that you move it right now. If it's jealousy, Lord, move it right now. If it's envy, Lord, remove it. Somebody still said the blood 
about the blood early. We're going to be having communion tonight at 5 o'clock. Yes. Then I want us to pray for Evan By. He's our former governor and senator and a friend. Yes. 